Good afternoon, oil traders, and happy news day. It is Wednesday, October 4th at uh, 4.25 p.m., or 25 minutes after the close. I'm a little bit late in doing my recording uh, today. Um, life got in the way. And uh, yeah, it is news day. And uh, API yesterday, as you guys know, called for a draw in crude inventories. API um, EIA was expecting a... Uh, a relatively small draw and API reported that we were going to get a much bigger draw. Well, EIA surprised everyone with an even bigger draw um, than what either um, they had expected or what API had reported yesterday. Um, so yeah, extremely bullish. And yet, we're ending the session down 1% on the price of crude. We did try to go up. Um, we tried to get, we got as high as 5065, 5066. Um, and at that point, I was thinking that I would get out at my original target price for the long position that I purchased from 5025 at a crude price of 5075. Of course, that never came to be. Um, I uh, left that kind of sitting there, and uh, yeah, I'm, I'm okay holding that even as we fall down. Um, I'm trying to rebalance the portfolio here as we. Uh, yeah, as we come down on the price of crude, um, and I'll be buying more long positions as we head down and as I exit some short positions. Um, so that being said, uh, we ended the session down one over one percent. Uh, we got as low as forty nine eighty, um, which was not quite as low as I thought we'd get. I was aiming for a crude price of fifty. Uh, excuse me, 49.55, at which point I would exit two short positions um, for a small profit and then look at buying a long position for the climb back up. Um, we did bounce. Um, I never got in on that bounce. I wasn't really interested. Um, but uh, we are ending the session close to the lows, which is rather bearish. So even more surprising given the news that we got. But so be it. Um, tomorrow, I think I might get my uh, sale price on those shorts, um, and I will be basically holding steady with my target of about um, 49.55, give or take, um, and looking to exit those two short positions. Um, as you guys can see from my tradingjournal.ca account, I'm very heavily on the bear side. So basically, getting out a few of those positions and rebalancing with a couple of long positions. Um, puts me in better stead for whichever direction we ultimately take in crude. Um, so that's kind of my game plan, a hint at my game plan for tomorrow, I guess. I'm kind of thinking through it still. But let me know what you guys think. Hit me up down below in the comments on YouTube or over on tradingjournal.ca where you can find more information on my portfolio, trades, results, etc., etc. Give us a thumbs up, subscribe to stay tuned, and I'll check back with you guys ahead of the markets open here at 9.30 a.m. Eastern Time. Till then, good luck. Cheers.